And here you see a collection of Czech candy. And I thought I would do a little bit of a taste test for you guys of some of these things. Now I'll be honest, I have actually eaten almost all of this except for the one flavor of Fodorka, the lemon one on the very end. <clears throat> Hello, welcome to my channel. This is the next part of my adventure in vlogging or whatever we want to call this. Anyway, today I thought one of the things that I would do is to share with you a few of the candies that I have discovered here in the Czech Republic that I enjoy. Let's dig in, shall we? First up, I would like to show you um, this known as lentilki. And basically, lentilki are the Czech equivalent to M&Ms, with one uh, major difference and one minor difference. The minor difference being the convenience of the packaging. Their small packs are like boxes like this, and they have a slightly larger box, but they, they have this really cool pull tab. You just pull the tab, open it, and then you have your standard M&M style candies. The thing about lentilki is that, to me, they are very crunchy. The, the candy shell has a little more crunch to it, which I find to be very um, pleasant. So lentilki is my favorite when it comes to little chocolate candy style candies. Another type of candy, it's actually not really a candy, but another brand of candy is one that we do have in the United States. If you're familiar with Pez, you know, the little plastic open the top and the little candy shoots out the neck, um, alien style. Anyway, they sell those here, but they also, Pez also makes this um, sort of uh, sweet tart-esque type of uh, vitamin C candies that I find also to be kind of nice. So Pez. And uh, as you can see, little disc, nice lemon flavor, soft to chew, chalky, nice. I think this is a store brand, but there's these uh, little, ch uh, almost like sweet tarts also, type of little bonbons. Um, extra shumive bonboni, so extra sour, I believe, bonbons. And these are also very nice and sweet and tart. So, again... Open. Carefully. Nice. And they're nice little discs of different flavors. Sour, sweet, crunchy, pleasant, good. There's that. And then finally, today, I have three different types of, they're known as Fedorka. They're basically little chocolate, not really a chocolate bar, but uh, when you open it, uh, they are chocolate and usually some sort of like a, a wafer, almost like a Twix in a way, as I recall. And... This isn't quite as nice as, say, uh, the, the milk chocolate from Germany or Switzerland, but it's regular chocolate, and the inside is like crunchy little wafery, 
and this one is uh, chocolate with hazelnut. Very nice. This is same thing, but with coconut. I'm not sure I've had this one yet, so we'll give it a shot. And by the way, I'm sealing these back up because otherwise <laughs> that's enough sugar to break off. Again, the wafery. Wait, the wafer inside is mm, doesn't have much flavor, but a mm, little bit of coconut there. It's, it's kind of subtle, but not too bad. But the one I'm excited about is this Fedorka with lemon, lemon, lemon. I'm a huge fan of lemon so we'll see I have not had this kind before Porca se Porca se citra novo chi tut chuti chuti chocolate and lemon flavor mm. pretty straightforward my check is <laughs> ah my check friends would be cringing right now laughing I'm sure but we will open this one and see what we get again chocolate little wafer a little bit of wafer and layers actually so let's see yes lemon good lemon mm. subtle it doesn't overpower the chocolate, but it tells you it's there. Lemon. I'm a fan. Ooh, chocolate, lemony, fedorka. You have my vote. That that's exceptional. Mm -hmm. Nice little nice lemon aftertaste. Not overpowering, but mm. so that's my little candy corner for today. I will now retreat and try to avoid any kind of, you know diabetic coma and hopefully with these things open i won't be tempted too much as the editor of all of les's videos i decided to cut this one short and go with it as is because les is being lazy and he needs to be punished for not doing what he should be doing which is to create other fun videos for you so please understand that i'm working very hard to get him back under control and hopefully we can keep doing these videos going forward. Stay safe out there. Wear a mask.